Hello and welcome to GPCA TV. I'm John Baker from ISIS and I'm here at the 13th annual GPCA forum in Dubai. I'm talking now to one of the speakers, Daniele Ferrari, CEO of Versalis and also now President of CEFIC. So Daniele, thank you for joining us today on GPCA TV. The circular economy is sort of gaining momentum now. I just wondered if you um, could tell us how you think the chemical industry and particularly the plastics industry should be responding? Well, John, thank you. And uh, the chemical uh, industry and the plastic industry has an opportunity here not to be seen as the problem, but to be seen as the solution of the problem. And we can do that by truly repositioning our image, first of all, but also concretely proposing and suggesting solutions. And uh, the only way you can do that is to do it in partnership with the other actor of the value chain. So that's why we are all working together, first of all, to make sure that the perception is not uh, all on the producer side, but is generally on the cultural element of how you handle waste from production. And then we work together to be active in providing solutions for recycling, reuse, and renewable material, which at the end of the day takes us into the circular economy principle. So we are the leading player in this field. Right. And what should producers be doing specifically? Well, the producers can do a lot of things. First of all, they can uh, work alongside their customers to provide polymers which are better recyclable. And you're, you're talking about both in terms of composition and in terms of eco-design. And then certainly can work with the whole industry in terms of cultural shift and trying to understand that plastics and waste in general are not an issue, but uh, it's a resource today that we need to treat as a resource management and not as an issue management. And what's, um, could you just say a little bit about what Versalis is doing? We are always uh, embraced the, the so-called circular economy today, but the sustainability before that aspect of our business. So we have always tried to provide classic chemical solution alongside renewable or sustainable solution. And uh, we are building up a complete fully integrated platform, which we are now uh, complementing with the acquisition of Mossy Gisolfi Biotechnologies, Proesa, and the plant to produce bioethanol and biointermediates from biomass. And that's a proprietary project that we are incorporating in our technologies. And then uh, we are truly partnership, having partnership with every actor of the chain. So we have plants in the ground already, like the Matrica joint venture in Sardinia. We are partnering with companies like Genomatica to design the enzymatic part of this transformation. And uh, acting with the different uh, actors of the value chain, we are pursuing a strategy which really started five or six years ago. So we are doing that by steps by step and building up our integrated platform. And there is an interesting example that I was talking about today of uh, how to create synergies between customers and is this uh, artificial turf in uh, grass equipment, which we have partnership with uh, companies which made the yarn, like uh, Radici, company that can make uh, the artificial support, and making sure that instead of uh, sending that material to incineration or disposal, after seven or ten years when it needs to be changed, we can now fully recycle that and put it in good application like sport protection equipment or safety equipment. That sounds very interesting. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Mm -hmm.